when planting your vegetables and it is not growing it is very easy and simple to get your vegetables to grow in your garden stick and stay welcome to jamaica farmers hut exploring the future farmers of jamaica it's all about farming viewers and my subscribers welcome back to another episode of jamaican farmers hut and in this video it's all about make your plants grow in your garden it is very easy that's the reason why most of the farmers we raise fish we have a fish tank where we raise fish the fish water it is a very very important role play in the garden it make the the, the the plants grow very powerful and strong it is a natural fertilizer for plants it is a natural fertilizer for plants stick and stay my viewers don't move yes my viewers and my subscribers as you can see in my little vineyard here yeah three days ago them never look this healthy let me show you what's going on here these are some cucumbers and trust me after three days giving them some water from the fish tank trust me marvelous these are some okras and trust me look at that yeah and my viewers i'm gonna show you something i did have a little pepper tree over here notice this little pepper tree here it did look droopy like it never going to make it this is what the fish water does you know what i mean the leaf was yellow and you know as you can see it still have a little bit of yellow inside there but trust me the fish water is powerful magnificent i'm gonna show you the next thing what the the fish water does i have this tomato plant here it was drying down as you can see there's a lot of dry limbs was on it and trust me after a couple days giving it the fish water it is the only two time i give it the fish water look what happened it started to put out new sprout it started to blossom and you all know we all know that um these tomatoes you can cut off the, the sprout and plant it back and as you can see there's a lot of sprout that i cut off here and plant back since i started giving it the fish water yeah leaves them start to get back green yeah the fish water is very powerful i tell you there's a next little pepper tree sweet pepper tree here it never have on any blossom look as you can see there is blossom yeah there's a next thing that the fish water does it's a miracle water look at this lime tree here you notice all those new sprout it farm from the fish water the two day I give it the fish water look that that is what happening yeah new sprout is coming out yeah so trust me with yours there is one more this banana tree here as you can see it's a new barn leaf it never have that barn leaf before since the two day I given it as you can see this leaf is more fresher than the rest it is a new barn leaf after giving it the fish water the fish water is very powerful there's a lot of thing here I can show you what the fish water does look here this cane here did send up a little sprout after give it the, giving it the fish water look what happened you notice how, how, how stout it, it is yeah look here these are some cucumbers yeah the fish water is powerful my friend the people time to raise some fish once you have a little garden you you need to raise some fish there's the next magnificent i have some little 
I have about three root of Kalalu here. Three root. Look what is going on. There is some there is some blossom from the Aki tree. As you can hear the bees them inside there. There, there's a, there are some blossom here on it. But look here. This Kalalu plant never look this bossy. And as you can see, yeah, look over here. As you can see, yeah man, them bossy up. Alright, this Kalalu over here never have on those sprouts. After a couple of days giving it the, the fish water. The water from the fish tank. That is what happened. Yeah, so trust me. I have I have a tomato plant against this banana plant here. But this tomato it catch but it wasn't growing. And look what happened. Look here. As you can see, this is the the arm um, tomato. It started to fight the banana plant. It wants to pass it now after giving it the water from the fish tank. The water from the fish tank it is very powerful. Trust me. Yeah. It is very powerful. Here I have a miracle plant here. This miracle plant, as you can see, most of the blossom is off because of the rain. But trust me. <coughs> yeah. This is the blue, the blue ver, ver, vervain, the blue vervain. But here in Jamaica we call it vervine. You can see the purple blossom here, yeah. But in Jamaica here we call it vervine. Trust me, it's it's a miracle plant. The only plant you can dry it up and boil it at any time. You know what I mean? But like a plant like this now, this size. If I'm going to make some tea, I just cut three leaves off it. Wash it, put it into, into the cup, throw the water on it. That's it, good to go. Yes, my viewers and my subscribers, right about now, this is my fish tank. I want to show you the fish, them, my viewers. The fish, them, I come up now, we can too rush them, because when them, we rush them, them gone down the bottom of the water. But I'm going to show you. Oh, I have to stay here, my viewers, for a little while for them to come up. Okay, my viewers, let's see if I can grab them. Yeah, oh, one come up and see me and gone down back. All right, look over that side, my viewers, look over here. All right, all right, all right. Yes, my viewers, yeah. These fish was some little banga in and them grow very fast, trust me. They grow very fast, my viewers. So yes, as you can see, the greenness of the water, that is the fertilizer, you know what I mean? I have a drum of water here that catch from the roof. As you can see this pipe, all the water from the roof run through here, come into this drum. So this drum is my rainwater. All right, this one is leaking, it's not holding any water, so. When the water is very dark and green, you know that the fertilizer is in it and it is ready. So that's the time I take time and bail it out. Here is my pan that I use, bail it out, and I bail it out and I water the plants in with it. So when I bail it out and water the plants, I go back into the drum, yeah, to take out that water to put back inside there because you have to replace the water with the rain water you know what I mean yeah you can't use the chlorine water that's what I say so yeah man the fish tank water the most powerful water when it comes to farming yeah uh, uh, me, me did always I see this guy come at, at, at the pan come full so many jugs load up in a vehicle and drive gone and I say wait and what I'm up to but I never know I never know the secret of yeah, the fish water, you know what I mean? From the fish tank. Yes, my viewers, okra. Have some okra to be here. I, I eat many okra for this little plant here. You know? It was the same okra tree that I have here. You know? But the next piece did grow too tall. The next one did grow too tall, so I cut it off. And it sprout from here and started to bear. It never stopped bear. You know what I mean? Lately, my viewers, I plant this mint here. This is it. Colon mint. 
cologne mint my viewers this is one of the sweetest mint you can think of yes one off let me refrain myself one off the sweetest mint you can think of when you, you when you make a cup of tea with this you don't want it to finish and if you just walk and brush against it you smell it all the way it is very strong it have a very strong nice smoothing scent you know what i mean i have i have the we call it we call it we call it thick mint there's a lot of name for it yeah but this is the next mint it have a very high cement um smell it, it, it's have a very high smell it, it can also go into soup yeah and this is over here this one over here is the pot basil it's the next mint also so yes the viewers here early time jamaican farmers up. so don't forget to like share and to subscribe to the channel don't forget to hit the notification bell to see the next video come out, coming out when you have a little garden you can pick something you know what i mean yeah there is always something to pick i can cut a cane you know what i mean yeah i have a next little, a next little slim one over here but it is so slim but look at the root of it there is two other one coming up look at that very powerful don't it so that first sprout is not gonna be so big but the second sprout will be you know what i mean so yes my viewers this banana plant now is my apple banana plant it is inside of a crate so as soon as i find the space i'm gonna dig a deep hole and put in the crate and everything inside here you know what i mean lovely kalalu you see the kalalu and the, and the fish water from the fish tank it is very powerful too kalalu this kalalu never have on any branches so big and look by a couple of days wow magnificent me viewers so yeah man once you have a little garden you can have a little fish pan where, where you raise fish you know what i mean yeah so once again a little fish tank i'm gonna show you a little fish here i'm gone down in the water as you see me they're coming up yeah. Me viewers, I'm going to show them again. Hold on, my viewers. I'm going to show them live in living colors, my viewers. Show them live in living colors, my viewers. Oh, them going down. I'm going down, but them going down also. Look. See that? You see that with yours? Yeah. Yes, my viewers. Yeah man. My fish them that who, 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 who give me that strong powerful fertilizer, you know what I mean? Yeah. I have a, I have a round leaf yam here. As you can see, this is a round leaf yam. I'm gonna show you where it plant go back all the way up on the house all right the round leaf yam plant right here yeah right over here so i'm just giving it some time to get fit when i see it started to dry down when the leaves them start to get pale up you know it is ready to dig yeah so yes my little garden here soon extend it you know my little vineyard soon extend it to over here yes my viewers what again I'm, i have a new farm that i want to show you what's going on on the new farm yes i have a new farm i'm going to show you yeah i have a neighbor farmer so i'm going to show you what's going on on that plantation all right my viewers me can't pass can't pass my tv back i'm gonna show you what they go on on my tv back oh my tv back look remember say i was i, I was i was attacked by goats you know what i mean so i have to back it around but yes as you can see my turmeric my turmeric my viewers my, my turmeric is very grow very tall look what's going on there's a lot of turmeric down here yeah and as you can see like every day there's a new ginger sprout i'm gonna show you a new ginger sprout right now that is a new ginger sprout 
this little one here this little one here is a new ginger sprout almost every day there is a new ginger sprout rise so this is ginger knife right here there's a knife right here so i just dig to the root and cut off a piece of ginger and i get a piece of ginger to put on my fish yes my viewers you don't know right that's how it go yeah man sweet pepper inside yeah so all right going on the new farm now my viewers yeah show you what's going on on the new farm new farm looking nice yeah for the first time yeah so let me show you what's going on my viewers here's a car there's a car bonnet for the door for this farm yeah all right farmer jack is going on fine because he have water also here yeah yeah all right show you what's going on funny new farm yes my viewers this is the new farm my viewers yeah this is the new farm my viewers yeah Save up the mold for back of me. I don't know why I'm out to do it. Like, I'm out to show so some seed inside the back of Cut off the top of the back but he have his water here. His water over there. He's a serious farmer. Yeah, these are cucumbers. So, I don't know. Seems like he's going to transplant them. You know what I mean? The cucumbers he's supposed to plant. Uh, he, 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 sh he should plant them in one one into, in, into this. Pan these pan here, but yeah, me viewers, cucumber here, yeah. I don't know what is this. This look like cabbage or pop chow or something. Yeah, cabbage pop chow or something. You have some pine here. He's going on pine. You have some pineapple here, me viewers. Yeah, want to plant something or then go and catch and grow, you know. You just need to plant. Alright, I, I give him some pepper sucker and look here. I give him I think one, two, three, four, five, six, six pepper sucker. And yeah, we plant them right here. Yeah, them catch. Them catch. Them just need some time to get stronger, you know? We plant something else over here, but oh he said he plant corn here, but I, I told him the corn is very you know, they are very near. So I don't know if he's, he's going to, you know, rearrange them. I don't know what he, he plant over here. Or if he plant anything over here yet, as yet. He need to clean the line. Yeah, he, he need to clean the line. Get all those bushes away. You know, although we plan to cut down all those bushes, get them far away, you know, cut down the land low. Yeah, that's what you can look through. Because when you have too much bush, you know, the place get crowded, you know what I mean? So yes, my viewers. Yes, my viewers. At the new farm. The new farmer. Yeah? And I have a next thing to show them, my viewers. The pumpkin I have over here. Yeah? The pumpkin I have over here, my viewers. I have a, a set of a uh, pumpkin sprout that is sending off a lot of pumpkin. I have a pumpkin here, you know. <laughs> you see that, my viewers? I have a pumpkin here, and I cover it with trash. And I, I, I pick one lately. Yeah, I pick one lately. Lately. All right. There is a big pumpkin vine, my viewers. This pumpkin vine here, and trust me, this pumpkin vine is sending out a lot of pumpkin on it. Look here, my viewers. This pumpkin vine is sending out a lot of pumpkin on it. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah man. This pumpkin vine here is sending out a lot of pumpkin on it. This pumpkin vine is so big. It's so big my viewers. It's so big. Here is the next one. Here's the next vine again scattering away. Scattering away so I have to lead it back here. Keep going on this side alone. So I have to clean up this area here. Get rid of all these. These grass. So yes, my viewers, look here. Pumpkin. Pumpkin from over there. Come right over here. Yeah. 
So I don't know if any pumpkin inside here. That's when I go through, they go search inside it. Yeah? Have a next vine from down here come up. And me have a next pumpkin over here too. A pumpkin everywhere you now. Show them what they go on with yours. Show them what they go on, so me have pumpkin here so too. See that? Yeah? It will fit it because the leaf, the leaf don't dry yet. This is the leaf. This is the barn leaf for the pumpkin. So when this leaf dry and come off, you know it is fit. So yes, my viewers. It's all about the fish tank water. Very powerful substance, yeah? Yeah, man. See you early time Jamaican farmers, alright? So yes, my viewers and my subscribers. You see how inside here, these are quaker bush all over. Very hard to get rid of quaker bush. You have to find the root. When you find the root, the man cut the root, yeah, take time and dry up. But trust me, notice it. Very green and nice. If it, will, if it was some vegetables you plant, them dry up after. But like the quaker bush, very green and nice. Yeah, but behind the cub here, I have two banana plants here. One here. Oh, this is a plant. This is a plant, yeah. yeah. That is the big breed banana tree. Yeah, so yes, my viewers and my subscribers. But and if you're new here, my name is Ever Slick. To the slick. So I'm here say, Jamaican farmers. So. Well, upon love and, and respect, my viewers and my subscribers and my hand subscribers, big up on yourself. Well, I know everybody, big up on yourself. You're peace. And I'm gonna be out.